Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Alicia. Today I have a mini Maurice's haul. I really wish I had a store in my town. Um, Northern California has some, but of course I'm not driving like five hours. And then in Indiana, of course, my hometown has a Maurice's. Um, I'm hit or miss. I do check their website pretty much every season and I checked this um, and they, I think they were having like an end of summer sale. Almost everything here was like $9.99. And that way I think I'm stuck with it. Um, you can return things, but it's $5.95, I think for the whole return. Um, so if you're only returning one item, it's not really worth it because you're getting like $3 back or $4 back, whatever. Um, so anyway, I have tried this on. Um, I will try it on and film it for you guys to try on. Um, but anyway, let's get in it. First piece, this will probably be a giveaway. If there's anybody out there that likes this in a 1X, the first person to tell me, um, I might, I would probably ship it to you. Fingers crossed, I can ship it for cheap. Um, but I was so sad. I didn't know what to do with Maurice's. So I used to be like an extra large, extra, extra large. And in my experience, they ran kind of big. So I didn't know whether I'd be a 1X or a 2X. They do have a size finder, which told me a 1X, but I really just think I'm a 2X. Um, I loved the colors on this. It is 100% polyester, but it's just too tight. So either it has to go to Goodwill or to somebody, just because I don't think I'm gonna hassle sending it back for literally $4. Um, but if anybody out there likes it and would want it, I'm happy. Uh, to send it on if the shipping is like five bucks or something like that. I'm happy to send it on to you guys. Um, but I think I could probably put this in a very small little bubble mailer and not have it be. So this does not fit. I might try it on, but it's just too tight. And I don't like holding on things for the hopes that they will fit. Um, I got this. This was a 2X. So they didn't have many sizes left in each of the things. So I did go back and I was going to do 2X and everything that had 2X, but only two of the things had 2X. Um, and this was kind of like a surprise. I forgot what I ordered before the vacation, but I really like this. I like the color and the kind of crochet detail all the way down. Um, so I think this will be a good top. I can wear it to work as is. And then I could also, you know, put a cardigan, etc. So I really like this. It's soft. This is a 2X. Um, so this top was 100% when I really liked it. And then I got this little cardigan thing, which is a 1X, but it fits. So I think this is also going to be a win. Um, it's very hot in California a lot of the time. And ever since they fixed it, like the, our air conditioning, our, our building used to run cold at work. And now it kind of runs either true to temperature or warm, in my opinion. And so lightweight t-shirt material cardigans like this are kind of my friend. Um, so they have a small sleeve, which I like. I just, for whatever reason, I'm not so into the sleeveless anymore. I think my arms are just have too much flab. But anyway, this is just a little t-shirt cardigan, which I like and I think I will get a lot of use out of. And again, for basically 10 bucks a piece, you really can't beat it. Um, and I'm interested to see how this looks. Um, I'm filming a Wantable today and this, but you'll see Wantable first. And there was a green tank that you can't really tell whether the accent's navy or black. And so I kind of wonder how this will look. So I may try that on um, in this video to see how that looks. So this, I don't know, like I was just quickly going through and because the prices were so cheap, I was kind of just hitting things. I guess in my mind, I thought this was going to be a more dressier shirt, um, but it is just a t-shirt material um, and t it's a little too small. It's not like too small so much where you couldn't wear it, but it is a little tight. So a 2X probably would have been better. It has little cuff sleeves, which I'm kind of now just noticing. Um, I think in order to make this work, I'm going to have to do some fabric glue because I see, I know when you wash them, you're either going to have to iron this or they're just going to get all kind of scrunchy. Um, but I like the polka dots. I don't have anything polka dot and, um, anywho, it's just a little too small. Or I really should say a little more clingy than I would like. Um, 
And then the last piece is this green number. It fits, um, but I'm kind of so, so about it. Um, I think you can doctor it up. So I'm going to see, I'll put some jewelry on today when I show you guys. Um, it's kind of a, I want to say bat wing, but that's not the name. What's that? No, I, I can't think. Whatever the bat wing's called, where it's kind of bigger up here. Somebody tell me. I can't remember what that's called. But I almost don't like that um, in this particular one. Um, but it, it is just a literal big square. And I think that might be part of the problem is that's fine for my stomach. But up here, it just kind of hangs in that bat wing sort of style. For the love of me, I can't think of what that's called. Um, but anyway, so technically this fits. Green is a good color on me. Um, I think this also has that weird thing where the sleeves aren't fully sewn. It has a zipper back detail. So this was not a hate or a real love, but again, I kind of am just going with that. I'm stuck with what I bought from Maurice's. Um, my second bag didn't come with a invoice, so I don't even know how I would return anything. Um, I don't know whether I can go, because I don't normally, I don't think I sign in, so I don't know if I have a record of it. Um, but anyway, I do think this could be okay for work. I will try it on and we will see. Um, so this was my mini haul because I really am getting desperate for work clothes. And um, I know several of you have been like, why don't you just go shopping? Because I, I haven't been happy with some of my boxes. Honestly, I think I haven't been happy with my boxes because I do not like my stomach. I've gained, if we're going to be honest, 30 pounds plus my vacation weight, which I think the vacation weight will come off that for sure. Um, I, I already in the last two days, I haven't been eating as much as I have on a cruise. Um, so I'm just not happy with how my stomach looks. And I do think that kind of, oh, I know it biases me on how I feel in clothes. So I really, I want to lose weight. I wish there was some magic pill because I want to, I have all the reasons in the world. I want to be here for my daughter as long as I can, but for whatever reason, I can't stick to it. Um, cravings get me. I've always been a person where I feel like my stomach is bigger than average because I feel hungry, like legit. Like you feel like you really need food. So I don't know. Anyway, that was a little tangent. Oh, I was saying, but prior to our trip, I went to, let's see, Old Navy. Um, I went to JCPenney's. Where else did I go? I feel like I never have luck at TJ Maxx or Marshall's. Like once in a blue moon, I will find a top or a pair of pants there. But in general, the plus size section for me in California is never a very good one. So maybe that's better in like other states. Um, I don't like the plus size section at Macy's for whatever reason, at least my Macy's. Um, but I couldn't find anything at Old Navy. I tried a couple things on. But for me, I feel like Old Navy used to be a place where I could find gems. But ever since they switched to the all sizing, um, they often don't have the size I need because I think they only carry a few of each. And the fabric um, was just terrible on this one dress. The dress had potential, um, great color, great pattern, but the way it was cut was just wonky. And the fabric was like the coarsest, yuckiest um, polyester. So I kind of feel like some places I feel like to to battle, what's it called? I am a lot of loss for words. Uh, battle the inflation have maybe cheaped out on their clothing. And I personally would rather them just add three bucks to the tag and have a better quality cut fabric style. So I honestly, I'm kind of just at a loss. Um, I've walked through Torrid. My Torrid doesn't have anything ever that I want to try on. I did see some things online, but you have to pay for shipping. And I just, I don't know. I'm not motivated. There's only one or two things. So I didn't do that. Um, so honestly, I wish, I wish there was a magical store that had <laughs> Alicia style cut items. But um, so one of you suggested Kato. We don't have a Kato here. I did look on their website and I feel like they're similar to Maurice's, which is how I went over to Maurice's and got these few things. But I'm kind of at a loss. Um, occasionally, I find a piece at Walmart I like, 
But again, that's kind of a needle in the haystack. And currently my Walmart seems to have gotten rid of the plus size section. It went away for like a month and now there's a very tiny little section. Um, so I don't know, Target, I did find the dress for a cruise, but the dress is I think too, I think too low cuts. I don't know whether it's low cut. I have to look in the mirror, but I don't know if it's for work. Target, I often don't. I might like the style, but the cut or the fabric or the fitting isn't good. So I don't know, guys. Honestly, I do feel like I'm stuck with clothing boxes, which is sort of okay with me. Uh, but I have been having hit or misses lately. Anyway, that was a big rant. Um, so let's do the try on and see what we can do. All right, let's do the first top. I love the color um, and I really uh, like the, it's not quite a crochet, but kind of a lace detail. Um, and I have the Liverpool pants on that I got today in my um, Wantable. And so this is definitely one way that I could wear it. Um, I'm not sure about the length of these, which is not really the point. Um, so I need to figure out that, <clears throat> but this is definitely one way I could wear this to work, but I like this top. You could put it under a cardigan, under a blazer, um, just wear it by itself. Um, so I'm very excited. I got this from Maurice. All right. So I am back with this top. Um, I wish this top was bigger in the stomach. You'll see in a second why the pants probably should be sized up. But again, I'm blending two videos here. Um, I like this. I like the black. I like the polka dots. I think it looks really good. From here up, it fits fantastic, um, which is my problem with a lot of 2Xs. They're too big up here, but fit, fits down here. So anyway, you can see now that these pants in particular do that give me a muffin top or the flowier top. It's not as noticeable. Um, <clears throat> so that's why I said earlier, this top kind of fits um, with the right pants. It's not so bad. Um, I am torn. Oh, I keep talking about these pants. I'm sorry, guys. That decision will be made before you see this. Um, but I am torn on these pants because I do think they fit my legs and butt. Um, and if I just wore flowier tops, it wouldn't matter. Um, but I don't know. Anyway, um, I, this top, I, I, like I said, is a keeper just because it's not worth the five bucks to send it back just to get four bucks back. I do like it. It is a little tighter on my stomach than I would like, but I do like how I look in this top. Um, oh, not that I would wear it. No, I think I'll show you this with something else, but this is the cardigan. Um, and so you could definitely wear, well, let's just put it on. Um, I would not wear a cardigan with this top, but you could, um, let's see what we have. So I guess this kind of dresses it up a little bit and would maybe camouflage the stomach. Um, so this also could be a work outfit. I am not, yeah, a work outfit, not a workout outfit. So honestly, this kind of does camouflage the stomach problem honestly this is a super cute i think work outfit um i do think these pants have to stay one way or the other i will say if i'm gonna be honest as cute as i think these two things look together i am not generally a layerer um because it's hot it's hot in the building um especially when we're i mean august september we fight to keep uh, the cold going um, just because it's so hot outside. So I do actually think this is a cute work outfit. This might be a good work outfit. So I did not plan on putting these together. And again, I would probably not want this extra layer on, but I kind of like this. Oh, I will say that sticks out. So I'm not sure that can, uh, I'm not sure that kind of, oh, it doesn't on this side. wonder why it does on this side. So I'm not sure this is possible to pair, but I do like it together. 
Um, I did tuck it up. I kind of wonder like how much it would come through. Um, ah, I like this outfit. Anyway, all right, on to the next. I did not expect to like that so much. All right, this is the one that I'm looking to give away if anybody thinks they would fit a 1X and like this. I like the colors quite a bit. It is even tight here, so a 2X would have been best. It is tight. Now, it's not like, I mean, it's tight and not wearable. Um, <clears throat> so I do think it's a little bit larger of a 1X maybe. Um, but a 2X would have been great, and I would have loved it um, with these pants. So anyway, it doesn't fit, and I don't like saving things. So if any of you, again, first one to comment, if you're a 1X and would like this, I will ship it off. All right, guys, I like this better than I thought I did, and I know I'm blending two videos at this point. These were the earrings I got in Wantable. Uh, anyway, I, if I can get, oh, I can't get them in my ears. I have my other ones on, just a second. Um, so I'm sorry for those of you guys that I'm blending these two videos. Anyway, I got these earrings and I really like them. So this, this is the top with those earrings. I like this top better than I thought. And so this top is, it helps blend your stomach when these pants might be a little top tight up here. Um, oh, dolman, dolman, <laughs> dolman's the word I was wanting. So these are a little bit dolman, I think. This is very kind of square, but I don't think it's too boxy necessarily. Um, so I kind of like that it flows. I could wear this top with jeans, with these pants. Um, and I do like this earring. Now I probably wouldn't wear this earring and this, but I wanted to bring out a necklace and just kind of see, you know, how that, so I would not wear these two things together. But I do think a necklace kind of helps break up the chunk. Um, do you guys agree? I do feel like the necklace kind of breaks it up. Um, but do you also agree? I don't think I would wear these two things. They're kind of competing. Um, which I like these with this, but I just, I think this kind of shirt lends itself to like a bigger necklace. So anyway, I'm kind of happy. I feel like I'm finally feeling a little bit more like I might have, well, two or three outfits for the first week of school. Um, <clears throat> so I actually like this top better than I thought. And these pants, I feel like they need to stay as they are. All right, I'm gonna try on one more thing and so I'll be right back. All right. Continuing on with the blending of two videos. Um, so this is the top I got in the Wantable, skies are blue. And I, in my mind, I kind of feel like the little color around the dot is navy, but I don't think you can really tell. So I wanted to see what it was like with this little cardigan um, from Maurice's. I was originally thinking that it would look good with a blazer, but I don't have a blazer. <clears throat> so I do think it's cute, but I don't, I don't think I'm sold on this top. It does have adjustable straps, so I could pull it up, um, which I do like, but, um, I think this is like $60, $58, I don't know. Um, so I think it looks okay, but um, like I love this with the cardigan. I'm not sure I love this, it's okay. Anyway, thank you for stopping by for my little Marisa's haul. Uh, I hope you have a great day and I will talk to you soon.